Uh, it's unacceptable, I think. Uh, it's not one guy. Yeah, Boucher had a nine, but uh, it's all, you can see all, everybody had a rebound or rebound or, 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 or so. So point eight rebounds is unacceptable, of course. <laughs> they had more offensive than defense, we need, it seems like. Uh, yeah, we need to just do a better job than uh, than, to, than than today. What was the reason for this trade that was just happening? Was it trading for different guys that you could pay and then just do better? I mean, hopefully we understand. I mean, we're professional basketball players, so I think we understand that we can only give 23 opportunities away for 20-something points, how many points? 30. 30. To me, not not to me. To be honest, I think I, I think uh, uh, I was. I think uh, me personally was not tough. I think um, you know it just happened. Uh, you're gonna have offensive rebound. You're not gonna have a. Mm, sometimes it's lucky. Sometimes he had a better position. Position. I think it's as a as a team. Maybe we were we were soft the, the, the collectively. Uh, because, you know, like I said, it's not one guy. Yes, Boucher had nine, but it's uh, it's all the way across the, 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 the roster. They have a lot of uh, rebounds. Uh, so maybe in that point, yeah, maybe in that. But even even that, like, you know, it's a rotation. In one moment, they had uh, five guys that were like seven foot, six, eleven. So that, that's a little bit disadvantage in uh, dressing the roster wise, you know. Uh, and they're attacking the glass. They're leading the league, I think, in the last five, seven games. They're like number one offensive rebound, offensive rebound team in a, in a, in a, in a NBA. So it is what it is. I think he's yeah. That, that's the that's the great uh, that's the great uh, describe. Uh, he's playing the right way. He's trying to play the right way. You know, he's still a rookie. He's still trying to figure it out. Uh, everything you know. So just, but I think just his pace is so unique in some kind of way that he can he can make a decision, and he can make other people run with him just by him pushing the ball. I mean, we turn. That's what. That's our. What, what we do. That's. I think we're the great turnover team. In, in, in the greatest turnover team in, in, in NBA right now. Um, we always turn like 15 or 20 or more. How many we had today? Oh, we were done. Oh, I'm looking, but they're like we don't have seven. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it's looking even the turnovers. It's not one guy. It's everybody. So. I think we are really good at turning the ball over. Well, you said before uh, how much you respect uh, Terrell Suggs and his role in the NBA. Do you look forward uh, to the first day you catch up with him? No, I think uh, it's just going to be like a normal game for me. Uh, he's a great, he's a great uh, player, great, like for real, great, great player that he can do everything on the floor. Who is controlling the game? Who is the uh, in conversation for the MVP and the best player in the league, uh, he's dom he's so dominant that he's a uh, not just with uh, uh, his skill like yes his skill but he's so big and strong that he used that like he's really tough coverage for for every every single team in the NBA. Um, uh, I, I really really I mean I like to play with the best in the league and the best in the business. But uh, it's not. There's nothing gonna be nothing special for me. Like I'm, I'm gonna prepare myself like every other game. I mean, whenever, whenever, we, whenever we met, I like to talk to him. Um, uh, just because uh, mm, I don't have nothing against him, and he's always good to me. So I think we have a nice, nice communication, a nice relationship in some kind of way. It's not like we are texting or whatever. Uh, but I think. Uh, Yes, I think there is mutual respect in some way, you know, and, and I, I respect his game a lot. Uh, so it's always fun to play against the best. I don't play that, a ah, little bit, yeah.
Hey, Nicola. Uh, Davon Reed had the highest plus minus tonight in about 25 minutes, starting with you guys. Uh, even though he's kind of bounced in and out of the lineup, what does it say about him that he can kind of slide in and make such a positive impact? I mean, he, I think he, whenever he plays, he's doing something good, you know. Uh, I, to be honest, I don't even know what's his stats or whatever it is. But uh, yeah, as long as he's have a plus minus plus, that means that he's doing something on the floor. Uh, that is uh, when you, is it defense or is it uh, something? But um, that's a, that's a good uh, skill to have. That if when you're on the court, that uh, you're winning. So I think that's great. Thank you, guys. Pleasure like always.